Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. Today it is my Premier League predictions for week 25. Um, a few shocks for week 24, I will go through them as I go through this for this predictions. Uh, you know, the shocks and, you know, a couple of deadline signings as well. Um, if you haven't seen it already, please make sure you check out my big match preview. This week it is Manchester City versus Arsenal. Um, a few weaknesses I think both teams have got. Um, you know, it's, I think it's well worth checking out, especially if you're a City and Arsenal supporter. Um, and you're definitely going to the game. Um, but guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. And let's go. So the first game I'm going to try to predict and you can sit behind me is Tottenham versus Newcastle. Um, you know, uh, Tottenham very lucky to come away with a 2-1 um, win against Watford. They had their chances, but they weren't really taking them. Um, Newcastle on the other hand, beating Manchester City at home. No one saw that coming. Um, you know, it's one of the things I think where... Top teams expected to come out, and it don't really happen. Um, but for this game, I'm going to go for a 2-1 Tottenham win. The next one is Brighton versus Watford. Now, Brighton losing 4-2 to Fulham, losing it all in the second half. Um, for what I've seen, as I've just said, Watford did lose to Tottenham, but it's a very okay game Watford had their odd chance as well um you know if Watford played like they did against uh, Tottenham it could be a very interesting game for both sides but as my prediction goes I'm going to have to give it to Watford um I know what attacking power they got as well so I'm going to go with a 2-1 Watford win the next one is Burnley versus Southampton. Burnley um, drawing with Manchester United. Um, you know, uh, shining Peter Crouch on deadline day. He is returning to the Premier League. Um, then you've got Southampton who drew with Crystal Palace. Um, you know, two bottom teams really happy to get the three points for this one. But I'm going to predict it to finish a draw. And I'm going to predict a 2-2 scoreline. The next one is Chelsea versus Huddersfield. Um, you know, Chelsea uh, losing to Bournemouth 4-0 uh, this midweek. Um, yeah, again, no one saw it coming. Um, you know, it's one of the things, I think, where, as I said earlier with the City game, the top two was expected to win and it didn't work out like that. Huddersfield really are struggling, um, you know, under new management, but I think it might be a bit too late for them. So I'm going to stick up for the blue side of London, and I'm going to stick up for a 3-0 win for that one. The next one is a London derby. It's Crystal Palace versus Fulham. Uh, as I've said earlier in this video, Fulham did beat Brighton 4-2, um, and Palace drew with Southampton. Um, you know, I'll, to be honest, I can't see Fulham uh, getting their way at Selhurst Park. Um, so I'm going to have to stick up with a Palace win for this one. And I'm going to have to stick up with a 2-1 Palace win. Um, so, uh, the next one is Everton versus Wolves. Um, you know, Marco Silva under pressure, Wolves. Are doing okay in their first season. I think they're staying up now. I think that's 100% uh, definite. But I'm going to have to stick a draw on this one as well. And I'm going to stick up with a one all draw. I think Pitford might have a mistake as well. Um, the next one is Cardiff versus Bournemouth. Um, you know, Cardiff played against Arsenal this weekend. Just gone... Um, Losing 2-1, but fair play to us, or fair play to Cardiff as well for what they've done for uh, Sanna. Um, sorry if I mispronounced them, I really don't mean to. Um, and as I've said, Bournemouth beat Chelsea 4-0, so I'm going to have to give this game to the away side. 
I'm not expecting it to be a big scoreline. I'm expecting a 2-1 Bournemouth win. The next one is Leicester versus Man United. All Leicester drew with Liverpool. Um, where Liverpool really did need to pick up the three points. Um, well, as Man United, as I've said earlier in this video, has drawn with Burnley. Um, you know, it's going to be one of them games, I think. I'm going to stick up for the... I'm going to call this one a draw as well, I think. I, I can't see no, uh, neither team's winning this game. I'm going to stick up for a 2-2. The next one is my big game preview, so I'm just going to say the score. I'm going to go with a 3-1 City win. Um, you know, I've seen the weaknesses, I've written my own weaknesses down. So that's why I'll go with that scoreline. If you want to know what I'm thinking of that about that game, go check out on Big Match Preview. Um, the next one and the last one of this weekend is West Ham versus Liverpool. Um, Liverpool draw into Leicester. West Ham doing ever so okay, considering from where they were last season. Um... You know, but I'm going to have to stick up for the red side of Mercy side for this one. And I'm going to have to stick up with a 3 0 Liverpool win. Um, guys, the end of my Premier League prediction video. Guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.